Hey guys, it's Sahina. I know I posted a video quite recently of a book haul, well book related things and I let you know that I was alive. So today I have a day off from uni so I thought I would um, do some book related things again. I haven't got a review for you today because I haven't had the time in between um, to read a book and then review it. So what I have got is a couple of things that I've bought and I have been sent a couple of things for review which I haven't read but I will hopefully be getting around to reading and then hopefully from there I will have a review. Um, excuse the lighting in the room right now and if I look really pale, I'm not actually this pale, but basically I'm using my SLR camera for the first time to record a video and, um, and I'm sitting on the floor right now and the camera is on the bed because I haven't got a tripod to put it on. So yeah I look really pale and excuse the scarf, I look like a ninja today because I'm just wearing everything black. But I haven't been, well, since I'm home from uni, I haven't been bothered to change. So I thought I'd do the video, and it's quite early morning, and my eyes are probably going to look huge. But regardless, let's get on with the video. I think I might just have to take the glasses off. Yeah, okay, I'm just going to take the glasses off. Um, excuse me as I sort out the scarf again. But yes, basically, okay, let's finally continue with the video. Um, basically, I got two books for review. One I got this morning, and one I got sometime last week, or the week before. And the one I got about two weeks ago was a copy of um, Dead Romantic by CJ Skews. I don't know how the camera works on the focus and autofocus thing, so if it suddenly focuses onto the book and doesn't come back to my face and it blurs, then excuse me, I'm very sorry. Basically, um, let's hope you can see the book focusing on and this was sent to me from chicken house dum, 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 dum. and um, chicken house are a really small publishing company but they do some pretty amazing books and I actually did start this I'm on chapter I think four or five and basically it says that um, I'm really bad at summarizing by the way so basically it's to do with two best friends and they want um, a perfect guy, so they decide to make him. So it's kind of like Frankenstein, as you can see from the cover. So um, it actually began really good because um, one of the girls was in the graveyard and she was digging something up, and then the other girl happened to walk past and she was just like, What are you doing? Um, and then they became friends. But this sounds like a kind of dead romantic comedy, so. So yeah, that was the first book that I got for review. Um, the second one I got this morning. And I wasn't um, I wasn't aware that I was getting this book until it came through this morning. Mum brought the post up and I was like, oh hello, I have a new book. But this one is called Abyss. Let's see if you can see the cover by Trisha Rayburn. And I actually, um, basically it's part of a free book series. And the first one I've heard of called Siren, and um, Pulse is the second one, and this is the third one, and I haven't read any of the first two books, so I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with it since um, I don't know what it's about. I guess I could read the first two books, but if since I haven't got time to read in general, how am I going to read two more books to review this, right? Um, I might email them and ask if I could give it away, as um, put it in a giveaway kind of thing. Just reading the press release. I have no idea what it's about, and uh, the press release doesn't really say what the whole series is about, but if any of you know what it is about, then please comment below. Um, I'm going to probably post the giveaway, well, if I'm allowed to give it away. I don't think they... I don't know. Who knows? But basically, if I do give it away, then I'll post details um, under on the bottom of this video later on. If not, then I guess I could try and read the first two books eventually, and then review this. But yes, that was the second book I got, called Abyss. And the third book, um, this I wasn't sent for review, this I actually brought the other day. Um, and it's called, Does My Head Look Big In This? And um, because I recently started wearing a scarf, I've kind of been trying to research into different aspects of what I'm doing. Um, I don't want to go too into that, but basically I thought this was a good book because everyone's been talking about how great it is and how funny and self-depreciating it is. So. I would give it a go because it sounds like my kind of book and so far um, I'm up to chapter 4 
and it seems to be pretty good so far. So yes, that was the second, uh, sorry, third book that I got. And finally, the last two things that I also bought was these two notebooks. I got this one, um, it's like one of those magnetic pull ones, and inside it is, it's basically blank pages, um, one of those plain ones, and the other one is lined. And they were like, um, I think this one was £2 and this one was, they were both £2 from the <clears throat> from the shop that I always keep going on about called The Works. And um, I am a huge addict to notebooks and journals, even if I don't use them. Like these two I haven't actually got a purpose for. But because I saw them and I really liked them, I bought them. And I do that a lot about notebooks, I just buy them, even though if I, even if I don't have any use for them. But I will eventually find something to... Um, use these for maybe I'll put in book reviews and stuff like that and uh, who knows who knows guys who knows so yes I got those two and um what else oh also um if you guys have read the book warm bodies is it warm bodies the zombie one yes warm bodies um it's coming out in cinema soon I think and uh, Noreen and I and a couple of other friends are gonna go watch the movie I haven't read the book because um, I'm not sure why I haven't read the book because it sounds pretty awesome so I'm gonna read the book probably um, before I go watch the movie and then I'll post a review on the book and then me and Noreen might do a video blog together talking about how the movie was it sounds really good I love um, the main guy in it. I think he's um, Jennifer Lawrence's ex-boyfriend or something and I love Jennifer Lawrence, she's amazing but basically he looks quite cute which is always a plus for a movie, right? And the storyline sounds pretty good. Um, I'll probably have to decide whether the book is better or the movie because normally I'm always for the books. Books are always better than movies apart from the case of Lord of the Rings I think and Holes. I don't know if anyone's read that book but it's not always the case that I find the movies better than the books, it's only occasionally, so we'll see which one is better. Um, I don't really know what else to talk about. So that's all I have for you today. I hope this video hasn't been dragging on for too long and my face is still probably really pale. And you probably couldn't even see the covers to the books properly, which I apologise for. I'm going to have to find somewhere better to sit next time and actually be away from because my window is direct right behind. So all the light is just flying onto my face and you can't see a single thing that I've showed you. So I am sorry about that, but um, next video I'll try to find a more darker place. Probably do it on my bed or something. We'll see. But yes, that's all I have for you today. I hope you guys are having a great week and I have to get back to doing my essays and some work. So I'm going to leave you to it. Noreen will probably be posting a review or something soon because you know she's quite crazy like that. She posts everything. So, you know. Um... So it's goodbye for now, have a good week, adios.